Hello. Hello. Can can you hear me? Can you say? <laughs> Hello. Hello. Can you hear me? Yes. Okay, that's good to hear. So, how's your evening so far? You. Oh, what's happening? Do you have fever or what? Are you no. sick? Okay. Now. Are you done eating your dinner? Are you? What? Are you done eating your dinner? Are not yet done. Are you? Oh, no. What are you doing? Can you hear me? Yes, I uh, see him. Okay, very good. Are you done eating your dinner or not yet? Yes, oh, uh, so, eating my dinner. So what did you eat for your dinner? It is um, rice. Rice, peas, soup, and then... Vegetable. All right. Fish, vegetables, and are you full now? Yes. Okay, feel. that's great. And now, yeah. are you ready for your test? Start your mm -hmm. test. Uh, are you? Okay, so actually, uh, this test would be given on um, last week, but mm -hmm. are you listening to me? Yes. Okay, so now this evening, all you have to do is to answer that this test eight okay okay do you understand i understand okay very good and i know that all of this is very easy to you am i right easy yes it is very easy for you to answer Right? Right. Okay. So now in this evening, yes, we are in started starter test eight. So now let's proceed. So the first one here is this. Okay. So listening starters. Okay. So all you have okay. to do is to listen the audio in order for you to answer. Okay. Do you understand? Okay. okay. I understand. Good job. So now let's proceed to the next. Oh, so we are now in task one. Read the questions. Listen and write a name or a number. There are two examples. Okay, so as you can see, there are two examples. And in order for you to hear the example, I'm going to play it. Okay. Okay. Okay, so here we are. Oh. Okay, wait for... Um, mm. Part 2. Look okay. at the picture. 
Listen and write a name or a number. Uh, there are two I don't examples. I don't Who's this girl? I don't see. Pardon? I, I don't see the question. I see the example. Yes, this is the example. Listen first the example, okay? Okay. Okay. Part two. Look at the picture. Listen and write a name or a number. There are two examples. Who's this girl? She's my friend, Pat. Sorry, what's her name? It's Pat. You spell that. P T A T. How old is she? She's nine now. Nine? Yes. It's her birthday today. Okay. Can you see the answers? Now you listen. Okay. So now, do you hear the example? So let's proceed to the next slide, okay? Okay. Do you understand? I understand. Okay, very good. So now let's proceed to the next slide. Okay, so here we are. Oh, so we are now in this task. Read the question, listen and write, write a name or a number. There are two examples. Okay, so listen carefully the audio in order for you to answer this. Okay? Okay. Okay, so good luck. Okay. Now you listen and write a name or a number. One. Pat's cousins are at her house today. That's good. How many cousins has she got? She's got twelve. Pardon? How many? Twelve. Two. I like playing with Pat. What's her favourite game? The name of her favourite game is Duck. Duck? Do you spell that D-U-C-K? Yes. It's a very funny game. Oh. Three. And where does Pat like going? She likes going to the beach. Which one? She likes going to Shell Beach. You spell that S-H-E-L-L. -L. Shell Beach. Oh, I know. It's beautiful there. Four. Pat likes reading, too. Does she? How many books has she got? She's got 20 books in her cupboard. 20? Wow! Five. Pat's reading her favourite book. It's about a really funny teacher. Oh? What's the teacher's name? His name is Mr. Lorry. You spell that L-O-R-R-Y. Mr. Lorry? What a funny name! Okay, what is your answer number five? Uh, 
Okay, so now are you sure with your answer here? Yes, I'm sure. Okay, that's good to hear. So now please read the question number one. Is how many cousins has Pat got? Okay, so how many cousins has Pat got? Your answer here is 12. Are you sure it is 12? Okay, very good. So you have one point now. So Pat has got 12 cousins. Okay, so now let's proceed to number two. Please read the question number two. Number two is which, what is the name of Pat's favorite game? Oh, so what is the name of Pat's favorite game? It is talked. Yes, very good. So you have two points now let's proceed to number three please read is which which beach does have light to go oh so which beach does pat like to go to it is what is your answer here shell Okay, Shell Beach. Okay, very good. Shell or Shell's Beach. Okay, where is your answer now? I don't know. What's happened? Can you show me your answer now? Many books. Where is your answer? I see only the 20. Laurie, okay. How about the number three? Still, your answer here is correct, which is Shell. Okay, Shell Beach. Okay, so how about the number four? So you have three points now. Let's proceed to number four. Please read the question number four. Um, is how many books has that Pat got? Okay, so how many books has Pat got? The answer here is 20. Are you sure that, that it is 20? Yes. Okay, so your answer here is correct. It is 20. Okay, so how about the last one? Please read. Yes. What is teacher name? What is the teacher's name? Can you repeat? What is the teacher's name okay very good <laughs> so the teacher's name is mr Laurie. Laurie. okay very good so now can you count your score you've got five over five Okay, so in this part, you've got five. 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 Yes, good job, because in this fast one, you've got a perfect score. Okay, so since you've got a perfect score, do you have any question or any Teacher. clarification? Yes. I have a new name. Yes. Meow, meow, is that? <laughs> okay. So now, do you have any question? Any question or no? 
or not, brother? Yes or no? Do you understand about this part? Um, I understand. Okay, so now let's proceed to the next slide. Okay, so here we are. So we are now in task two. Listen and tick the box. Okay, so the same thing again. All you have to do is to listen the audio in order for you to answer. Okay? Okay. So now let's proceed. Okay. Who's dad's talking to on the phone? Who's dad talking to, mum? He's phoning grandpa about dinner. Can Alex, my friend from school, have dinner with us? Not today. Okay, so what is your answer, number one? Okay, let's proceed to... Oh, I can see it. Okay. Ooh. Oh. Hey. So here we are. Uh. Um, can I doing? sing again the one? Okay, no problem. Who's dad talking to on the phone? Who's dad talking to, Mum? He's phoning Grandpa about dinner. Can Alex, my friend from school, have dinner with us? Not today. And how about the number two? I'm oh, okay. sorry. Two. What's the crocodile doing? I love the crocodile in this story. It's funny. It doesn't like swimming. So what's it doing? Eating? Not now. It's playing a guitar. Look. Oh, yes. <laughs> Okay, so now are you sure with your answer here? Are you sure? Yes. Okay, so now let's check your answer. Okay, so please read the question number one. Is, who is that talking to on the phone? Okay. Who is dad talking to on the phone? The answer here is letter B. Yes, good job. So you have one point now. Let's proceed to number two. Okay, so please read the question number two. Is what a dog crocodile doing? What is the crocodile doing? Please read. What's a the crocodile doing? What is? What is? Okay, so what is the crocodile doing? The answer here is the crocodile is doing are playing guitar okay very good and look can you see the crocodile eating the, the sandwiches yes it looks so it's good look, it looks like the sandwiches yummy yes it's a yummy okay so remember you have two points in task two. So let's proceed to the next one in order for you to continue answering. Okay? Okay. Okay, so now let's proceed. Okay, so now the same thing again. All you have to do is to listen the audio. So here we are. 
Three. Where are Hugo's pens? I can't find my pens, Grandma. They aren't on my desk. Are those yours, Hugo? The pens under the lamp? No, they're Sue's. Oh, mine are there, next to the TV. I can see them now. Good. Four. Which boy is Sam? Look, Dad. There's Sam. He's my new friend. The boy in the jeans and black jacket. Not him. Sam's got a black jacket, but he's wearing brown trousers. Oh yes. This in again number four. Okay. Four. Which boy is Sam? Look, Dad. There's Sam. He's my new friend. The boy in the jeans and black jacket. Not him. Sam's got a black jacket, but he's wearing brown trousers. Oh yes. Five. Which is the girl's favorite picture? These paintings are great, Mrs. Dor. Those flowers are beautiful. Thank you. Which painting is your favorite? The one of the houses? That's nice, but no. My favorite is the one of the goats. I love that. Me too. Okay, so now are you sure with your answer? Number here? say numbers mm, number say is how beautiful. Number Num number five C is how beautiful. Oh the goat. Can you see the painting yeah. of goats? Yes, it is. It's a very beautiful, right? Right. Uh, and how about the flowers? You don't like it? And the houses? No. Oh, you don't like no. it? It's the A and B. Okay, so now let's check your answer here. So now please read the question number three. Please read. Number three is... Where are Hugo's pens? Where are Hugo's pens? Can you repeat? Where are Hugo's pens? Hugo's. Hugo's. Okay, so where are you go pens? The answer here is letter B. Okay, let's check. Yes, good job. Your answer here is correct. So you have three points. Now let's proceed to number four. Please read. Number four is... Which... Boy is Sam. Oh, so number four. Which boy is Sam? The answer here is letter A, which is wearing the jacket and the brown trouser oh. or jeans. It is wearing jacket and trouser. Okay, so the answer here is letter A. Very good. So you have four points now. Let's proceed to number five. Please read the question number five, the last one. 
is which is your girl's favorite picture? Oh, uh, so which is the girl's favorite picture? The answer here is letter C, the painting of the goat. Let's see. Yes, very good. So your answer here is correct. So now, how many score you've got? This five. Yes, good job. You get five over five. Okay, very good. So good job with this part, which is task two because you've got a perfect score okay so since you've got a perfect score do you have a question or any clarification regarding this no part? are you no. sure no oh because it is very easy for you right right okay so now let's proceed to the next slide Okay, so now we are in reading and writing. Are you ready for the reading and writing? Yes. Are you yes. sure? Okay, so now let's proceed to the reading and writing. Okay, so we are now in task three. Read this, choose the word from the box. Write the correct word next to numbers one to five. There is one example. Okay, so now. Horses are beautiful animals. The one in the picture has four long. Okay, so the answer here is this one. The example, okay, the you answer here. So now, you're going to continue answering one until five. And then in order for you to answer this, choose the word here below, okay? Mm-hmm. It has a brown tail on its body, too. Lots of... What do you think the answer here? Lots of blank enjoy riding horses. Who ride the ro horses? Who? 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 Who's riding the horses? Okay. 